Full details in the blog post linked in the description. The blog post will be kept up to date with any new details that appear. Many AirPods users have found that even after placing their AirPods in the case, they won't disconnect from the device they repaired to. This is a serious issue because the AirPods will continue to stay on and probably won't charge properly. In fact, they might be losing power as well. AirPods are a great product, but just like everything else, it's still not completely perfect. Let's explore the possible reasons why it won't disconnect. Sometimes the issues could be coming from the device the AirPods are paired with. One way to fix this is to reconnect your AirPods to your device again. This could fix any software problems and resolve the connectivity issue. Here's how. Open the device your AirPods are connected to. Head to Settings. Look for Bluetooth and then tap on it. Search for your AirPods name in the paired devices. On most devices, you can either tap on the name or you'll find an icon next to it. This will open up a menu with the settings for the AirPods. Find the Forget This Device option and give it a tap. By doing this, you'll unpair the AirPods from your device completely. After that, put your AirPods back in their case and give them time to charge before trying to reconnect them again. If that did not work, try resetting your AirPods and then reconnecting them by doing the following. Forget your AirPods from your device. Put your AirPods in the case. Open the lid. Hold the button until the light flashes orange then white. This can take about 15 seconds. Repair your AirPods with your device. Sometimes your device can experience a software bug. These are errors in the software that causes users to deal with minor problems. Luckily for us, Apple is quick to roll out new updates to fix any issues with all its devices. So the first thing you should do is update your AirPods. These updates are usually done without your needing to do anything. But if your AirPods aren't connected to an iOS device, or if you choose not to connect it, they won't be updated. So here's what you need to do. Pair your AirPods with an iPhone or an iPad. Ensure that the device has a stable internet connection. Put the AirPods in their charging case. Leave the AirPods for about 30 minutes or more. Any necessary updates will be automatically downloaded within less than an hour. If you want to know whether your AirPods have been updated, you can follow these steps. Head to the Settings app on the Apple device. Tap General. Select About. Choose AirPods. The numbers next to firmware version indicate what software the AirPods have. One reason your AirPods might not disconnect when you put them in their charging case is that the pods aren't placed correctly inside. You'll have to open it again and ensure that they're positioned correctly inside, then shut the case. Other times it could be because the lid on the charging case wasn't fully closed or something is preventing it from shutting completely. So give the lid a look over to make sure it's completely closed. If you find that your AirPods are still connected even though they're properly placed in their case, it could be because the connection points are not clean. You can start by just blowing into the case or rubbing it using a Q-tip. If that does not work, you can try cleaning it more thoroughly. In this case, here's what'll need. Cotton swaps. Microfiber cloth. Isopropyl alcohol. After you've gathered your supplies, follow these steps. Take your AirPods out of their case and wipe each one with a damp microfiber cloth. Spray the cotton swabs lightly with rubbing alcohol and clean the inside of the case near where the connectors are. Repeat the same process for the AirPods so the connection points are clean on both ends. After that, wait a little while until everything dries out. Then, place the AirPods back in the case, shut the lid, and see if it disconnects from your phone. If your AirPods still won't disconnect, take a look at the comments. I will also make sure to update the blog post, linked in the description, with any new fixes that appear.